at Quilix Productions. Alex, Steph, the English homework, what was it? Oh, we just had to finish the reading. Hey, are you guys talking about the reading? I thought it was hella gay. <gasps> That's offensive! Tommy, how insensitive! Yeah, Tommy, the proper terminology is homosexual. Oh, I see. I meant that the reading was hella homosexual. Tommy, that's not any better. That is just as offensive. Honestly. What? Homosexual is way less offensive. That's not even the point. Using gay or homosexual as something negative, like that's hella gay or you're so gay, is messed up. Yeah, that's right. Nuh-uh. Wait, that's not how I meant it. We're reading Brokeback Mountain. I literally meant that the content of the reading was gay. You mean homosexual? Whatever! Oh, that's different, I think. Right? Well, in, in that case, I, I guess it's okay to use it. Really? Sweet! Hey, Steph, you're gay! <laughs> I don't think he gets it. Uh -uh. Not one bit. Tommy! Tommy! Hey, are you guys talking about the reading? Hey, are you guys talking about the reading? I thought it was hella gay. Oh, I see. I thought that the... Oh! Oh, I see. I thought that the... I meant that the reading was hella homosexual. Wait, that's not how I meant it. We're re... Ha <laughs> What? What? Stupid printer. Yeah, Tommy, the proper terminology. Blah. Are you gonna give me a go, Mark? Oh, yeah, where's my beeps? I want three beeps. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Three thumbs up. Are there, we are we talking too fast? Why is there two probably in two sentences? That sounds kind of weird. Because he's kind of confirming the, like, probability, the probability. I don't think that sounds right. Really? I mean, I think it's fine. Man, he hell high! <laughs> Did you know I started work on this piece just about a year ago? And look how short it is! It's probably had a week's worth of actual days put into it, but that's how much I'm strapped for time recently. As I was animating the first brother and sister short, this script slapped me across the face and begged to be animated. I wrote it out and instantly wished that I was animating this one instead, but as I had already started animating the other script, I saved this one for another day. This short is definitely a bit closer to what I'd like to do with Brother and Sister were I to make it a series. It has just a hint of social commentary, or at least explores some social issues just a bit. I'd ultimately love to have an equal mix of Brother and Sister animations that are just funny stories and ones that have something to say or some real social topics to explore. As far as animation goes, I've moved to a nice HD 16x9 format that will make things look better than ever. I've also changed my color palette a bit, I've started to prefer more muted colors, and I redesigned each of the characters to make them cleaner and easier to work with. Will we see more brother and sister? Only time will tell, but I've definitely got some more of their stories itching to be told. Oh, also, go find the easter egg if you haven't yet. It's got the voice talents of Alan, Lauren, and Hubert, some of my fellow film majors. I hope to bring more of these guys into my future works. All right, I'll stop talking now. Bye. <laughs> what the hell? He was probably on drugs. Yeah, probably. <laughs>